All right. Went ahead and reloaded and right in the middle of all this. Hopefully, uh, I have the items situated the way I wanted. Uh, actually, weren't we putting that away? We might have time to do that. We also... Yeah, we had no more healing. Oh, yeah, we do. That's what we wanted to do. Take that out. Yeah, I think that's the best we're going to get. We got plant monsters to take care of. Oh, yeah, we have the... No, we don't have the Matilda on this good. Yeah, having a save right in the middle of the chase probably wasn't cool. Or useful, rather. It's a fucking joke! Sounds like he's right on me. I think we skipped red herb in our uh, run. Gotta keep going. Possibly. Yeah, I'm having trouble remembering what the loot was. Actually, can we map? Uh, I think that's where we came from. We missed something here. We'll probably end up having to do this run again. Yeah, we didn't even see the items that we skipped. More handgun ammo. There's the red herb. Oh, we got a healing or item box anyway. Oh yeah, we need to put something away for that. Honestly, the burner didn't seem like, or the flamethrower didn't seem like it did much for us. Oh yeah, we turned all this into Matilda ammo earlier, and that did less than nothing for us. Well, we have enough room for this now. It's also... Oh. Probably jump straight into this one. Let's actually use that now. And that'll make room for... Another hand grenade. Okay.
probably missed all this. Oh. Okay, he didn't care about the flash grenade so much. Maybe it's because he's still in a stun animation. I think we want that. We'll call it even. Ada! Where did this thing come Well, that took all of our rockets, which kind of sucks. I'm sure we would have wanted more of those. Well, if he's the last boss, then it shouldn't be that big deal. He wasn't the last boss. Well, he wasn't the last enemies. Oh, they're going down pretty simply anyway. Why could we set some of these? But I think that was more meant to be a uh, an additional rocket. Shit! Gotta get out of here. Lehan, we made it. Just like I said we would. Who's this? This is Sherry. Okay. Jesus. What was that? I don't know. I'll go. You take care of Sherry. Oh, no. Ink ribbon. We probably will use that. I don't know. We might have been able to do that last boss a little bit easier. Okay, we're out of ammo for the anti-tank rocket. And for you. I have a feeling we're going to need all of this. All we can muster. Uh, is there more ammo hanging out in here? Well, it's not all looted. So maybe... For the moment, though, we'll do what we can.
with what we have. Uh, Matilda. Flamethrower. Combat knife. Oh no, another large gunpowder. We could have made a couple more Matilda shots. Hopefully it won't matter. Look at you through all these flames, but hopefully it won't matter. You want more bullets? Be my guest. It's coming closer, I think. Come on! Want some more? friendly looking. No, we're just, uh, well, we actually just met last night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that would have been one hell of a first date, though. Yeah, you have no idea. Look, he might be able to give us a ride. <sighs> what if it's not just the city? Get Sherry out of here. over? I don't know. But if it's not, we'll stop it. Whatever it takes. Yeah, you're damn right we will. As long as we stick together, we'll be fine. Come on. Hey, you guys can adopt me. <laughs> adopt uh... you? <laughs> we can get a puppy. A uh, puppy? And a parrot. I always wanted pets, but my mom said they're too messy. Huh. Next up on this boring Wednesday is a song to get your blood pumping. All right. Well, that uh, occurred a little bit sooner than I expected. This will be a bit of a short episode. I don't know if I'm ready to give my final thoughts yet, but we have experienced an A-side playthrough and a B-side playthrough. I don't imagine, like, they honestly weren't super different as far as, like, the story goes. Yeah, the playthrough was 
a bit different. But I have a feeling Leon A side and Claire B side are going to be pretty much the exact thing but swapped. I don't know if we necessarily need to do that. I don't know, you guys have to, might have to let me think, or know what you think about that. Yeah, we'll let the credits play out and then I'll give more thoughts. It's a little distracting. Well, I'll just turn my headphones down. Uh, so, my thoughts on this story. Like I said, I don't know if we necessarily need to do Leon A side, Claire B side. Uh, it's just one of those things where, yeah, we pretty much played it all. We might see Claire's B side heavy weapon or heavy handgun. But that'd be about it. Uh, we will play the. Uh, other game modes? I saw Ghost Survivors or something like that. Uh, when I would load into the game. We'll check that stuff out. But as far as the main story goes, it's a ton of fun. It was the game that got me into the Resident Evil series, and the remake definitely wasn't a letdown in that regard. Looks beautiful. Uh... Zombies seem to take a little while to go down sometimes, but near the end, that got better. Uh, playing it on hardcore was definitely a, a challenge at times, especially on the Leon B side playthrough. I felt like we spent most of that desperate for ammo. Could have been that I was crafting the shotgun shells early, and the shotgun shells before we got the upgrades. I think there were times it took three of them to take down a zo single zombie. Probably wasn't worth it. Might have been... But then again, making handgun ammo probably wouldn't have been super worth it either. Because it was for a gun... I don't want to say it was a dead gun. But it's for a gun that you know, we couldn't find ammo for anymore. Uh, making more magnum rounds I think would have been better on that flip side though. Oh yeah, we also never made any of Claire's acid rounds, so I don't know how that one worked. Uh, but yeah, if I'm not really remembering Resident Evil 2 from back in the day, I don't remember if the spark shot was a thing, I don't know if the flamethrower was a thing. But those are pretty fun. We should use a f utilize the flamethrower a bit more on regular enemies. Uh, it didn't do a whole lot versus bosses. Not without a huge investment into them, but we had to dodge more often than not. So, uh, there were a few spots in the story that I thought were a little weak. Uh, I'm trying to recall one in particular, and I can't though. I know I had one in my mind not too long ago. Well, since nothing comes to mind right now, it must not have been that weak. Uh, yeah. It's not coming back to me at the moment. So yeah, it's a good story. Oh. I don't even think it was that the story was weak. It was a few of the discrepancies between the A side and the B side. In fact, yeah, we might as well cover that. That's probably what I thought was the weakest aspect of this. Uh, I was hoping for a bit more differences. Like, yeah, we started off later in the game, but we did all the same boss fights. And I imagine that fight against uh, Trenchcoat guy, well, it did replace the uh, fourth stage... William Burke and I would guess. The one that we had the minigun for as Claire. But yeah, I imagine in Leon's A side, it's the same boss fights, same story beats. And there was just too much overlap that didn't make a whole lot of sense. Like the first time we fight William Birkin, how did we both 
go through the same ladder way or stairway or uh, walkway. We both fell through the same one, both fought him the same way. It would have been nice if, you know, there were a few changes to each of the boss fights to show that one or the other had already been there. Might have been a little too much extra work, but, uh, or even, you know, on an A-side fight, a couple less versions of William Birkin, or a couple different versions. Uh, but yeah, maybe, you know, either have more versions of William Birkin, or only fight, like, the one first stage, third stage on the A-side, and then the second stage, fourth stage, B-side. Something to that effect. But, uh, the fact that we both had to get the same wrist ID from the guy in the ra the radiation suit in the plant area. I mean, that technically couldn't have been possible. I like how Claire was going for the antidote to save Sherry. We were going for the virus. That part kind of makes sense. And the whole self-destruct thing happened when Leon picked up the virus. So that makes sense for Claire's playthrough that she was wondering... Or, you know, all of a sudden everything's starting to self-destruct. It's because Leon is busy doing that. Oh, we didn't score great there. C. Eh. That's fine. For first playthrough, I'll take it. But the fact that they both ran into Annette, who tried to stop William Birkin, and we had to fight him in the that arena, you know, it's just like... There wasn't enough differences to really call that an A-side, B-side. Which was a bit unfortunate. Essentially, I just felt like I played through Leon's campaign and Claire's campaign. Might as well have done both A-side campaigns, but then we wouldn't have seen the train fight, which wasn't much, but maybe the flamethrower was the perfect weapon in that case. Who knows? However, the gameplay felt amazing. Everything about the game was just so much fun. If you can overlook the little discrepancies between the A-side, B-side overlap. And just consider it, you know, Leon's scenario, Claire's scenario. And call it that. In fact, I almost feel like there shouldn't have been a B-side. Just had a Leon playthrough, a Claire playthrough. And you can kind of see the little differences. And then once you... You know, once the game registers that you beat it with both, have the final cutscene and all that. But yeah, I mean, I can't really complain. This was a ton of fun. Let's see. Oh, I don't even think we unlocked alternate costumes for Leon. Uh... Oh, we did unlock Claire's B-side. We also got the fourth survivor. Okay. We did get a couple. Or we got a Leon costume. But I think because we got a C rank, we might have missed some of the costume. Or maybe we'd have to do his A side. A uh, new game mode has been added. Extra modes in the main menu. Extra modes. Yeah. We want to check out this ghost survivor stuff. Which it had recommended that we complete the campaign first, which we just did. And now we have the fourth survivor. Ah, uh, we can check out the fourth survivor. This is Nighthawk. Come in, Alpha. Alpha, do you read? Nighthawk, this is Hunk from Alpha Team. Man, I thought you were all wiped out. I've been trying to- I'm at to... point K-12. Need info on my extraction. Guess there's no keeping down the Grim Reaper, huh? My extraction point. Relax, Mr. Reaper. I'm headed toward the front gate of RPD. Pick you up there. Got it. Okay, so we have to leave. Gotcha. Uh, oh, wow, we have a full inventory already. LE5, submachine gun. 
32 shock capacity machine gun use uses a closed bolt and has high accuracy w870 shotgun a mup handgun and a lightning hawk we have a defensive item we can make some more magnum ammo and some more handgun ammo I imagine these will still combine to make shotgun ammo We got a poison heal, we got a toughness boost, a full and two full heals, one with a toughness boost. Uh, a few grenades and such. All right. I'm guessing not all of our pathways are open to us. It also seems like there's no item to loot. Okay, we don't have the tool to open any of that. Probably shouldn't voice the ammo quite like that, but... Probably should have wasted some ammo there. We don't know exactly what all we'll be fighting when and where, though. take any damage though. I don't know if this was the path we needed to take, but it seems like we didn't have any more options. Uh, honestly, I think we keep our defensive stuff on us. I think we just need to come out here. Oh, hi dog. That's a lot of dogs. Hopefully that'll blind them behind us. Uh, okay, we're off to a banging start. Let's use this. Oh, we can't go that way, so we have to go past. Oops. Torso. That wasn't enough to stun. In fact, that didn't seem to do much of anything. Has this path opened up? Hopefully, because that path down there is a dead end. Uh, okay, so we're on the other side of that gate. We need to go up these stairs. Not one of you guys. Uh, from 
here. Yeah, it doesn't work this break room a lot. I don't know if this elevator and path will be open to us though. Oh, it doesn't look like it actually. So that could have been a mistake. Yeah, definitely different zombie locations and such. room. Ah, oh, we're going to the parking garage. Gotcha. I'm not sure what that noise was. I don't think I like it. Let's also use this. Uh, uh, resistance. A little swarm here. This is a perfect spot for me. For sight spray, please. Oh, I can't even get out of here. Combine those, might as well combine these. Oh, that's a lot of ammo. Oh, crap. I'm assuming this is the way we're going. Yeah. Oh, hi, liquor. I wasn't even looking. Dang, I couldn't even get the shot off. That didn't even kill us. Want to be prepared for liquors first. Or Mr. X. Uh, now we have to get past him. That didn't work. Okay. Let's retry that again. 
We're a little bit more aware of what's happening. I'm at point K-12. Need info on my extraction. Guess there's no keeping down the Grim Reaper, huh? My extraction. In fact, we'll combine these now. Ah, oh, we got less that time. And less that time. Lame. Relax, Mr. Reaper. Of RPD. Pick you up there. Got it. This thing really did nothing for me here. I think that would have been better to go for lake shots earlier. Also, let's equip you guys. You for the, the dog section. Flashbang should affect dogs, but I think we have to get it out first. Those ones weren't too bad just to run past. So many dogs. Most of them got stuck though, so that worked out. I don't remember what we fought here. I think it was another handgun situation. Try to run past. liquor spot yet, I don't think. Uh, we probably
probably should throw in a heal. This point we could probably go with our shield since it doesn't heal us at all. This one things get a little bit more dangerous. Okay, you just don't die. Not to this spot. Shield help, but we're in a bad way. There's more liquors to come. Once you get swarmed, it's not a good time. This is when... Yeah, this is when we ran into this guy. I think we need to drop him to one knee. As best we can. we got coming up now though, this is all new. I'm also not sure what path we're trying to take. Not this path. hear him moving. Let's just use you to be prepared. Oh, I'm just stuck in the piles of bodies. What the hell, Hong Kong? You're late for extraction. Fuck off, block. Gotta find another way out. Hey, I missed what that said. Crap. 
Hi, Mr. X. Oh, this is all blocked. Uh, block, 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 block. So we need to go through the west office. going for us. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Guess I'm going upstairs. nothing else in our way because we're just running past pretty much everything coming up. Uh, lounge. Can't really get through the door if you guys are just going to sit there. Come on. Take stairs. <laughs> or a ladder, rather. <laughs> so, where are we supposed to go from here then? Oh, the main hall. Out of ammo. Not that way, this way. You guys just sit there and play. won't help us I don't think looks like they're blocked at the top that's blocked <laughs> yeah. oh not dead yet oh no the stairs blocked going down oh you're gonna be the death of me little zombie <laughs> okay got closer Let's give this one more shot. I think I basically need to save all the defensive items. This is oh yeah, let's skip this. I'm at point K-12. Need info on my extraction. Yeah. There we go, we got the full 60. And we got six. There's no keeping down the Grim Reaper, huh? My extraction point. Relax. I'm headed toward the front gate of RPD. Pick you up there. Yeah. <laughs> I can 
serve a little ammo and pain. I don't know why we couldn't take the ladder in the library. We could take this ladder. I mean, it's probably because there was no place to go. I don't know what to do about this slide. There's so many dogs. Those dogs can't aim very well. deal with that area, I think. Like, just take the time to put those zombies down. It's too tight an alleyway to squeeze through. I don't know if there's a smarter way of doing this one. These things are ammo sponges, so... Taking them down is not the right thing. Fine, so they don't do much damage. Well, at least not when they're flailing like that. Well, that's a different story than the last time. story. Okay, we still have one flashbang left. Walk past this one. Nope. <laughs> that didn't work. Yeah. 
him. Can't say if we're in a better spot or not. Uh, practically out of heels. Oh. <laughs> Took my thing forever to close in. Probably didn't need it to. And then he dodged last second, which was annoying. Backed in the corner. With no defensive item. Oh, that's annoying. I forgot that he popped through there. I was waiting for plant people. <laughs> 